traffic. Good morning. I'm Kelsey Webb. Here's what's happening at 734. The final Columbus City Schools closure and merger recommendations are due in less than a week. The district's facilities task force met again yesterday. A trial is now underway for a man accused of recording himself torturing and killing a victim inside a Columbus hotel room. Detectives say they have Snapchat videos that show Timothy Kendrick killing Drew Bendelbaum in 2021. Also, a federal jury has convicted Hunter Biden of federal gun charges. He faces up to 25 years in prison and another federal trial in California for tax evasion. In baseball, Guardians beat the Reds in the opening game of the Ohio Cup. Clippers continue their home series with Iowa today. Storm Team 4, meteorologist McKenna King says sunny 84 today, more sun 89 tomorrow. And that's what's happening on this Wednesday morning. I'm Kelsey Webb on the WNCI Morning Zoo. Steve and Jimmy, happy Wednesday. Your celebrity news headlines in a moment, but let's explain our contest today. Spill your guts for Olivia Rodrigo. Call. Tell us a story. If you spill your guts nicely enough or, I don't know, entertainingly enough, someone's going to win a trip to see her in D.C., hotel, accommodations, all this stuff. Let's see. Dave and Jimmy, are you there? Yep. Tell us the headline of your story. I lost my virginity to my softball coach. That is worth hearing. All right. Continue, please. So I went to Myrtle Beach for a softball tournament, and we had a huge coaching staff because there was multiple age groups. Wait Uh, a minute. Wait. I'm afraid to ask this, but how old were you? I was 18. Okay. Oh, okay. A little better. And actually, the uh, coach was too, which also makes it a little bit better, but... um, yeah, he your came coach. Over. Wait, your coach was eighteen. He was a coach for the younger division. So but one of the coaches. Oh, okay. So this star. isn't quite the old person. No, moving in on it. Okay, no. not as taboo as we had thought, but you know, but uh, hey, it's story. It's just no, a good but story. The get you. <laughs> okay, that's headline an was good. Story was not scandalous. Yeah, you asked for good headlines, and she. Did well, we want a good headline followed by a good story. What? Well, yeah, I get it. Not, I was eighteen. I lost my virginity to someone else who's eighteen. <laughs> oh my god! Okay, I'm <laughs> I did. We want to be encouraging when it comes to spill your guts. Judgmental later. Yeah, we want to get now your celebrity news headlines. Some dude was arrested at a concert, Taylor Swift concert, in Edinburgh. No, Edinburgh. <laughs> anyway, Saturday night she was playing in Edinburgh. And is that how you say it? Or are you being like a Gen Zer? No, it says pronounced Edinburgh. Oh. oh, okay. Concert well. was stopped. So they could arrest this guy for lewd conduct. Mm. Yeah. The Scottish police superintendent said a 64-year-old man was arrested and charged in connection with a, with a voyeurism offense committed during the Taylor Swift concert. Mm. I don't know what that means. It's an odd charge. Hmm. Right? Yeah. I mean, was it this dude like taking pictures up girls' skirts? or? I think you're allowed to be 64 and go to a Taylor Swift concert and just stand there and watch, <laughs> aren't you? <laughs> I do believe. I got to look this up more. Okay. Why do men ruin everything? Can I just uh, let her have a nice concert? No. Uh, he's a troubled man. That should be women only at that concert. Why? Then McKinley could that's go. It. Women only and gay men. Because that's who she appeals to. No. Well, then let the market decide. So you Fun. can't go and experience it with your girlfriend? Apparently a 64-year-old dude couldn't. Well, he was voyeuring. What does that mean? A voyeur's watching. We'll have to figure it out. Okay, we'll figure it out. Okay. No, and your dad, you got to take your daughters. I had to take my girlfriend. I'm taking my kids but to, I didn't love it. to events I never wanted to see, and that's part of the gig. Yeah. I know. Dave and Jimmy, now your music Three news. Hours. So, Matt, Maddie Healy. Remember this time last year? Taylor Swift and Maddie Healy? It was running. this time. Well, he's Whoa. engaged. He's engaged. That so. is so crazy. Eat that, Tay Tay. Yeah, Tay Tay. Write a song about that. Rihanna okay. is not retiring. She's just working on the next album and she's starting over from scratch because apparently she didn't like what she had. All right. So much for Joe Jonas's flirty relationship with Demi Moore. Huh. He was spotted with a Lebanese model in Greece. Well, maybe That's they logic. have an open relationship. Apparently. Uh, the Sphere in Las Vegas, this big open entertainment thing, it's a real great place to see an established group, is walking back their lifetime ban of a fish fan who just ripped up a bong, ripped 
just ripped open a bong at... They were fish was playing the sphere on 420, and he thought it was cute. You would have had to ban the whole damn crowd. And right? well, he did it obviously. Well, if weed is illegal there, then why are they walking it back? Um, I, maybe, read, I read that story. Maybe they thought about it for a minute and went like, "Ah, he's a fish fan." Can and it's, it's a concert. Who fish knows? Fish. And hackers, hackers have broken into the ticketing service of the Gathering of the Juggalos. <gasps> why? I don't know. The ticketing service makes it sound like it's not. Ticketmaster. So I don't know where you get Gathering of the Juggalos tickets, but it is coming up. Maybe. Yeah, and it's always in Ohio. Maybe they set up their own ticket distribution Maybe. company, which is good. Yeah, to give they... people a break from Ticketmaster fees. Right. Okay, one okay. Uh, let me take let me take this now and see what happens. <laughs> I got I got time. Dave and Jimmy, are you there? Yes, I am. Can you tell us a story? And spill your guts. Uh, actually, I was calling about something else. Oh, never <laughs> uh, mind. Go the ahead. Guy at, the guy at the Taylor Swift concert, if you dig a little deeper, he was pleasuring himself oh. in mm-hmm. front of everyone at the concert. Mm-hmm. The, why would they call it voyeurism? Because I, that I don't know. It's not something I'm into, but <laughs> the lewd act was... The lewd act, he was pleasuring himself oh my at the God. God. Okay. Thank you. You are a fantastic listener. Yes. Thank you for having our back. Yep, thanks. Huh. <laughs> just, just, just when you think, we know it all. Nope. Somebody comes in with more detail. Yeah, that would kind of get you arrested, wouldn't it? Probably. You think. I went to that show, and that was the last thing on my mind. <laughs> this is Dave and Jimmy. You're listening to the number one rated morning zoo. With Dave and Jimmy.